do 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 Yep. Those were not even real birds. Those were 2D drawings of birds. I'll take three flash. Why the fuck? Trust no one in the dark. I get it. Oh, hi, guys. Yes, yeah, sure. I'll use one of the flashbangs they just gave me. I want to stun you guys up. No, nope, stun you. Sometimes it takes shockingly long to go, and then other times it's instantaneous. Instantaneous. I like how I kept him under crowd control with the light while I was reloading. That was great. So I traded some ammo uh, and two shotgun shells and a flashbang for two flashbangs. I'm always so tired. I'm just a writer in a tweed jacket. Um, excuse me, I am an author. Very somehow different. Oh, baby, shotgun. It's good to, good to I find. I had no real plan. I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Sure, let's try it. Well, this has a lot more ammo. Let me guess. The fucking kidnapper took the time to set up all these lights. Come on. I know I have a few seconds. Well, it's not as strong, but it's not so much weaker that it's worse. But it does chew through ammo a lot faster. I think I'm actually going to switch back. I don't miss very much. Not to toot my own horn, but... I don't miss too, too, too much. And I'd rather have the revolver be my weapon of, like, three shots to kill. And I missed once. That was the first shot I missed this whole session, I'm pretty sure. Honestly, I like you better, Double Barrel. Like, I already have the revolver. I don't find so much shotgun ammo that I don't want it to be, like, a boss kill. I, I like having it as just a boss killer weapon. Thank you. That's it. Lasted the perfect amount of time for that fight. How helpful. God, Alan. As soon as they step into the light, I just zap them to stun them. If necessary. hard for me to see. Alright, cool. <sighs> Man, the camera angle is really getting weird with this one. Speedy. Oh, shit. Haha. <laughs> Alright, I'll use some shotgun ammo. Especially because I got a... <sighs> the stun lock. Well, I already did my experimentation. I no real plan. 
I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Sounds like a reasonable plan with a kidnapper, Alan. Oh, oh, they almost knocked me off the cliff. Almost. Okay. Back off, please. My god, Alan. Haha, <laughs> they all just aggroed into the light. That's hilarious. Come on, do the crazy camera move again. Wow, that light is triggering all the way over here. That's wild. Excuse you. Cover me, light. Now, why doesn't Alan just pick it up and throw it on the path? Well, it was a lot easier doing it that way. Oh, my fuck. Oh. The dark presence was moving ahead of me in the same direction I was going. A cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? Okay, I genuinely do not remember, but I feel like that darkness is just going to be Alan again. What? What does that mean? Oh, are you a super speedy? Looks like it. Yeah, you're a super speed. Hello, friend. Would you please relax? Hello. Yeah, I saw you coming. Are you about ready to actually throw down yourself? No? Okay. Are you having fun? Are you trapped behind there? Oh, you screw You played yourself, idiot. You played yourself. Right into the freaking corner. That was mildly annoying. Ugh. I like how it procced the checkpoint twice. Come on. The darkness loves to turn you. The place the was dead. Was a ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe what a century. What is happening? What was throwing that stuff around? I am confused. Come on, barrel, protect me! <laughs> that was awesome. If I had been even in a slightly different spot, that wouldn't have worked as well. Oh, look, is it gonna collapse? Oh, no. How do I get through this terrible town? I don't need batteries. I want ammo for my gun. Zzz. Any of them, really. Oh my god. And more batteries. Not None of this is what I'm looking for. The only reason I'm really collecting the thermoses is because I end up looking for ammo and then I find thermoses. Ah, the spooky monsters of the refrigerators. Did they just hit off each other? My god, you guys are dumb. You played yourself right into the... Oh, okay. Man, when you actually have room, these things aren't threatening. It's only when the game forces you into, like, a super tight corridor to fight them. 
All right, guys, come on. Can we cool it for a second here? Really, that only hit the one? Seriously, why? Whoever designed this arena didn't take into account the giant structure in the middle that just blocks these things for free. Kinda, kinda made it a lot easier. Oh wow, I had a lot more revolver ammo than I thought. All right, because I just didn't shoot my way through that area. It's okay, Alan. No one's asking you to be in a hurry to save your wife or anything. And fight time. Ooh, look at that super old steam engine. Aww, you ruined it. Oh, I guess this is one of those you have to charge. Ooh. All right, well, I'm pretty safe right here. I, you know, as soon as I said that, I knew that the game would punish me for saying something like that, actually. I was kind of hoping. That was funny, though. All right, you know what? Screw it. I have so many batteries. All right, does this thing take three batteries? All right, just, you're not gonna get past this rock easily, so. Let's check out these little structures. What, did I just get keys? Oh my God. Oh, there's probably keys to this house that I needed. Yep. Flare gun ammo. That's cool. Anything outside of riding is a struggle. <sighs> I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake, using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Oh boy. Zane believes <gasps> it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. Oh, we're plagiarizing Zane, her crazy old husband thing. It's literally right there. I should be able to freaking see this thing. It's right there. And there's the fucking ground. It's right there. It's right there. It if you want to know what that's a reference to, uh, watch Louis C.K.'s story about being almost dying on an airplane. <laughs> that's what low visibility means. Wow, that applies to this. Great. <laughs> oh, no. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. Weird how that kind of faded in. I thought I had a flare. I am not wasting that flare gun ammo. It's okay. I can't wait to find a military grade sniper rifle. That'll be fantastic. Birds. I hate birds. What is this music now? I love how one of the birds just burns away. This music's cool. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll somehow magically come close again. There they go. We're making our attack run. I can't believe it didn't break when I landed on it like that. I came down pretty hard. Seriously, those just formed out of thin air. That actually was ridiculous. They just appeared. I guess darkness can just manifest birds, it feels like. Oh god, is it all gonna collapse? What is the... 
Oh, crap. What are we going to find in the mine? Obviously lots of bad shit. Tunnel goes to Cauldron Lake. <sighs> Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. I actually get headaches like that sometimes. Ever since I was living in Utah for school a few years ago, I started getting headaches every once in a while if I'm really de if I'm kind of dehydrated, where I just get like a stabbing absolute headache for half a second. That was not expected. <sighs> All this for a manuscript page. I didn't mean to. The page talked about Alice and how I saw her plunging into the darkness of the lake. I was still convinced that we had been to that house, even though it hadn't been existed for 30 years since the eruption. I didn't know what was going on. Not a new state of being, but I thought I'd mention it again. <laughs> You know, I apparently never know what the hell's going on. <laughs> Maybe I should become a writer like this. <laughs> yeah, I'm supposed to go up here. That thing actually moved and made me fall. Oh, hi guys, come on. Oh no, it blocked off all the light. That's gonna get opened by something. Yep, there it is, literally right there. Wow, that actually was allowed to hit me, seriously. Could they be though? I don't know if that's true. An interesting idea, but anyway. Hi right, guys. That didn't end well. For you, I mean. For me it ended great. All it took was a flashbang to kill you all. Skibi doo ba ba da ba 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 to make my way up this mine shaft oh, to order shit. to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. Maybe, just maybe, the machines designed to move things around in here could help me get around in here. That seems crazy, I know. I'm just a writer. I don't know how machines work. It's not an insult to writers before you try to say it is. It's more of an insult to Alan Wake here. Uh, doesn't feel jumpable. See, I want to get up there. Nope. I'm still alive. Why would you add ragdoll to that? I'd have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. Seems crazy, I know. I like how there's lights just strapped all over this thing. It is cool. Alright, I'm not going to try to get up there. I'm sure there's something. Oh, that's what this is for. Okay, so that's the way out. Where do you go then? Oh. Oh my god. All required steps. Unfortunately. D 
So how you guys doing? I'm just climbing a mine shaft. No big deal. Is there another switch? Oh my. Go down again. But I can't just be like, Alan, just drop. So they're really not that high. How high can I make it go? Why can it go that high? That is fairly la random. Okay. Alan Wake, tweed jacket wearer and writer. <laughs> what a badass. <laughs> As always, gotta explore the dress. That is worth already, even though there's gonna be new enemies. <laughs> always the pages. I fully recognize that some writer for the game went through. I don't even care. I'd rather take that damage than have to watch Alan one rung at a time climb down the frickin' ladder. Ski bizarre, bob a dip, bam better. Oh no, again. Yeah, you better fade off. You better back it on up. All right, we're gonna play it really safe. Okay, that's not what I wanted to throw. Really didn't want to throw a flashbang. I don't have that many. Great, another cable car. Just great. God damn it. At least Alan gets how annoying this is. Well, where's the birds? Come on, spawn in my face. Do it. Just waiting. Alright, you know what? Die. We're starting our attack run. Oh my god, seriously? That was very close. Flare gun's worthless. They never hit the stupid things. They're both too far away to be a problem. Yeah, they're fading away. It's apparently right next to me. Like, where is it? love how it didn't actually throw me out. Clean him up. Seriously. Haha, -ha, goodbye. Oh, I thought it was going to start rolling down the hill. Wow, I'm actually full on all of it. God, you're telling me this is close by, dude? Seriously? Why is there smoke in this fire? Come on, guys, I hear you. Let's play a game. Called Eat a Flare. Oh, 
yeah. That was a fun game, right? I have a flare. Ho, ho, ho. So glad I have the Cauldron Lake. Oh, that way? The eighth deepest lake in the world. Cauldron Lake is a caldera, caldera lake. Caldera? From volcanic it could be considered active, but it's not up to the 70s. No casual Wait, what? Despite some property damage, there were no casualties? What? What happened to the 32 casualties? The hell? Come on. Yeah. Yep. All right. Just power through, power through. Just keep dodging back and forth to try to dodge these freaking guys. Keep you back. Get off the thing. Wow, you're shockingly tough too. Man, these guys have like super darkness on them right now. Hey, I made it across. That guy was coming from behind me. Okay. Watch that nonsense. Kill you. Hey, buddy. Still only two shots. Better than the shotgun. Excellent. Hunting rifle is my bay. That was a pretty cheeky move there, guys. What's with the random fencing? Oh look, a manuscript page. Cross the mountain ruins. Oh my god. Yeah, these look like ruins, all right. Guess I am supposed to go up this way. I wasn't sure. Nice push, Alan. That's how a normal person pushes. Just smash your shoulder into it. Really? Yep, that... Oh, both legs exploded. How did you even do that, Alan? That's amazing. Oh, yes! I love it. Tom, 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 Tom. Whoa, what the fuck? I miss you, Tom. Hey, look, crazy... Talk to me. You talk to me on TV. Hey, look, the crazy woman loved Tom. Did you write this? I curse you, Thomas Zane. Hey, look, the darkness lady who's super evil loves her, loves Thomas Zane as if we already didn't know that they were together. I mean, I can still take it even if I use the hunting rifle. That's what I want. That's the good stuff. That's also good stuff. Oh, a lot of flares right now. I'm sure I'll need them right now. And there we go. I'm already mashing the flare button. Hi, guys. Where did that flare just go? Did it just... It fell through. It fell through the earth. I don't care if I'm using more flares than I got. That was effective. Those guys stayed far away. Excuse me, guys. I'm trying to deal with your friend over here. And just in time. Hey, buddy. Yeah, that happened, though. Oh, my first miss with the hunting rifle. Excuse you. I didn't realize you had friends coming to play, so I'll deal with them too. Hey, big boy. Get smashed. Whoo, that hit him. 
Nice, that went well. I used a lot of ammo and stuff, but that was still still went well. Alright, I got two full sets of ammo for the frickin' hunting rifle. I like how it literally just sent me back down into that room and then it's like, oh no, actually now there's like 20 guys in here. <laughs> of course. I want ammo. Hunting rifle ammo would be preferable. <sighs> oh my god. I want to end. As soon as I get to this lookout... I see Cauldron Lake. I thought I could make out the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. Had to be. This is a long-ass section. I was Chaos. close now. I had to get there fast. I dreaded what I would find. I'm dreading it too, Alan, for different reasons. Are you? Wait. Hey, I'm here! I'm coming! Oh. You don't seem darkified. Oh, I guess it's the lady. <laughs> nice one, Alan. Seriously, Alan? Oh my god, you're so dead. And there ended Alan Wake. He died slamming into the water at 100 miles an hour. There's the end of a chapter. Episode three. Hooray. Previously on Alan Wake, oh I'm haunted by the law. Alan, shh, baby. It was just a nightmare. Yep, this seems normal. Alice. I fell. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. I... You went through another rough period. What? Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. Oh my god. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. No, of course you did. You lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Bastard. It's okay, okay Alan. Just let go. <sighs> Still wearing the I jacket. Felt groggy. Whatever Hartman had bumped in me was making me numb. I felt like this was happening to someone else. Someone I was watching on television. Of course. I couldn't think. Couldn't focus. For next time, we find out why Alan Wake is here all of a sudden. But until then, my name is Pete and I will catch you guys later.